no hug, but no lift, clean shit, and no hug. Okay? Check out. Good luck. Wait. Three three minute rounds in the light heavyweight division. Bahatov and Tavares underway here in New York City, and what a combination by Tavares. They're going right after it. Oh, that Tavares left kick almost landed. Bahatov follows up. Oh, spinning back fist for Tavares. That was right on the money. It was right on the wrist that uh, Ar Artem landed it. And down went Tavares, and they were going after each other at that moment. Bahatov with the highlight reel knockdown. No feeling out period for these two. Bahatov throwing really crisp punches, a lot of them being slipped though by Tavares. High kick there. By Bahatov, counter by Tavares. Low kick from Bahatov. Looks like Tavares shook off that knockdown. Oh, a body blow now knocks him down. That doesn't look good. You know what? His body language is saying he's not going to continue. So we'll see then in the green, luminous green shorts, Big Mo Bakari, and in the black shorts, Luis Tavares. Nope, after this. Mo starts fast. Inside leg, big overhand right. That's a good oh, right that hand. That's a big hard right hand. Boot moves it back from that. He's got good it, it. He's speed. got a massive lump on his head already on the left hand side of his forehead. Massive lump has appeared. Oh, he that just was a great shot. Again. He's finished. Yeah, he's out. That's a really big hematoma on his head, and it's growing with each second. Big Mo looks on sea legs here. He's really in do. trouble. Speed of survival. He's getting up laboured, Big Mo. He is hurt. He's going to go for the head, and oh, again! That was oh, a, my that goodness, was that's a knockout. horrible knockout! That was a horrendous knockout, and he falls flat on his face. And out goes Tavares and leaves. Champion, ladies and gentlemen, the man in the uh, blue corner, Luis Tavares. Amazing shots, landed just yeah. flush. It was a superb showing. Two. Yeah, he does look big, doesn't he? It's a lot bigger. It's back, etc. But still, big is not better, better is better. Shots if they land, don't they? It's a good shot, you know, right through the middle. Yeah. That was a really good speed. shot, you know, the left hand. You will be only one of one of three people to go up in weight and win another world title, that being Ibrahim El Bastati in the first person to win it. That's oh, Anka von yeah. That was a big right hand he took though from Wilness. Big left hand to the body. In each other, out. five rounds is a a long time in there, isn't it? Especially when you're heavyweight. Fast hands though from Tavares, infamous. Nice combinations going in from Tavares. Makes him vulnerable for the rap. So that wobbled him, you know, Julie. See the back leg of Wilness just. Oh, nice right hand again from Tavares. Landing nice shots. Yeah. So the weight makes a difference in wellness. Power shots starting to come from wellness, but getting caught as well from Tavares. Stepping out though with that right leg. Sneak shots going in. Intact. Tavares. Good low kick. Constantly working to Vares. Nice counters to make him miss. So if he's moving his head like that and moving out the way, he needs to. Comes back with his own shot, so. Weight now, isn't it? Of Wilness is looking. 
Mike, as they say, but he's making him miss, Tavares, but it's sapping as well, someone walking on you all the time coming forwards. Strong low kick there from Wilness. Yes. Yeah. Span off the ropes very nicely, blood coming from the nose from yeah. Tavares. open as well. Oh, it's that's a, a good knee for yeah. Wilness. Oh. Heavy shots going in now. Nice knee. Wilness just rumbling forward all the time. Got to keep his hands up, yeah. Jabbing away, Tavares. Good shots, they were. Back comes Wilness. Oh, that was a peach of a shot. So that well. the knee, yeah, it just shows his fitness. So that sneak left hand through. in again. Wilness being the one to push forward now. Yeah, he's come back into it, hasn't he? He's scoring though, isn't he, Tavares, Julie? He's it is, um, Yeah. Good shot to the body, he fell about one. He did. Oh, that was a hard low kick. Nice shot. Nice combination. Tavares, and this has become a very important fight. Could he be one of only to snatch two world tiles at different weights? Just watching great fighters. And the new infusion oh, heavyweight champion go. of he's the done world it. in the blue he's done it. He's the only one of three. Massive congratulations first, to him. First one was Anka Van Gerstel. And ladies and gentlemen, the please, your appreciation is And now, Luis Tavares. Green shorts in Mohad Akram and Luis Tavares in the And one. The right hand that he throws so well. Not messing about at all. Drops and thinks he's out of distance. It's a nice, that was a nice uppercut. So he picks his shots. Sweet right off the top. That was a good shot. It didn't look much, but it landed sweet on the chin. Let his shots off. Spinning back kick, ace right into the liver. Fight's over. The fight is 100% finished. Well, there you go. A bit of an anti-climax, wasn't it? Well, when there you go. The it was a perfect place. shot. You know, we can sit up and go, oh, he laid down, but that was perfect. Let's see the spinning back kick. Boom, perfect. You know, it's his accuracy. We can all... Words being exchanged here. This fight is going to be more than just a fight. I think it's a bit personal. Yeah, it's because it's not uh, no I said about you. Round one. with this. Big shots going in, the head is shaking of Fatty Horsley. He needs to move. Now, see These that, are big see shots. That? You see that accuracy then, just how he moved back through the left hook. Good knee. Good as well. 
He circles you, Tavares, and, and makes you... You can't get balance with him, Judy, when you throw your own shots because he moves... Shaking the head. You know, this is scheduled for five round fights. It's going to be five hard rounds. He's not going to be able to do this. He's too, he's like, hands down there. And... And he's still just edging forward. Good combination. Moving in and out, jumping the shakes the head once again, but needs to come back beautiful. with his own shot. Beautiful. He's down the count. That was an absolute beautiful shot. It was a shovel shot. A la Oscar De La Hoya. You see that the right hand threw, and then he threw a shot underneath, just twisted his hand and angled the shot. He's going to come for it now. Let's stop him here. Kick right across the body there. Stopping the in, in, in hits track. Time push kick. Again shakes it off after taking shots. Pass moving around. Ottoman pushing forward. those up he needs to come back with his own shots he's absorbing a lot of Master shots that, here you know. it's going to make him extremely tired as well yeah. as well as dazed he looks his eyes are watery his face is all red he's still trying his know, best he's in there with the Fatty. top opponent yeah of world class opponent. Is, yeah. in the roy jones versus glenn kelly and again showboating a bit now Tavares. you're really good spinning back fist going to see that. <laughs> oh, oh! He's still not Daisy's tough cookie man. Towels come in. Towels in. He's taking too much, too much punishment. Too much punishment. Caught with too many shots, he walks up back so. sportsmanship. That, but you his know, his corner through the towel. In what can you do? Respect your cornermen, yeah. they're there for your safety. And still, infusion heavyweight champion of the world from the Netherlands, Luis the infamous Tavares. Gentlemen, you understand the rules that you're fighting to protect yourself all times, obey my commands at all times. Do you have any questions? Touch gloves if you like. Push back. We've seen the damage that Duke can inflict with the left hook. Two knockouts in two fights one night, total time less than a minute. Yeah, that's nasty power. His left hook is just nasty. Nice shot from Tavares. Ooh, that counter left hook. Some good eyes from Tavares. Liking his work from the southpaw. That opens up a nice right hand for Duke. Another one of his power shots. With Tavares not really hesitating, being the, the first guy to throw punches. Yeah, but he's not overthrowing them. That's why it's the smart move. If he sits on it, now he's trying to sit right. on it when it's the right moment. Right. But the first few punches, they're feelers. See, he's trying to jab, trying to feel, just get a reaction from Duke. And then he's going to try to counter the counter. Oh, good straight right hand from Tavares. 
You know, both of these guys would love a top oh. quarter pin. That buckle Tavares, and here's Duke's moment. He's going to close in now as Tavares backed up against the ropes. Got oh. hit again. Counter punch from Tavares. And now it's the fight we expected and hoped for. Yeah, but we knew it was coming eventually. But Tavares is content with his hands low. He was going in for the kill and is now backing up again. Fight. I think they both have some unique qualities that would make it a tough fight. I mean, Abena to stay technical. Uh, sorry, I mean, Tavares to stay technical could do a good job against Pereira, but Dude's aggressive power could give Pereira trouble as well. We haven't had anyone really pushing back up Pereira. Dude could do that. Left hook there for Tavares. And Luis Tavares! Fellow Glorilus, listen to my comments. Good luck. Shake hands if you want. Back to the corners. They'd rather not, Joe. Yeah, a lot of tension, a lot on the line. Tavares seemed to handle it well. Yeah, Bain has just got a lot of power in those straight shots. I mean, especially when he fought Vahi top, I saw, you know, Abena mixing this nice lead uppercut, which I think could be a good fight tonight. It's a high kick again from Abena, who's having a pretty slick start here to the first round. Violently, but Abena says, look, I made one mistake, I won't do it again. And, and same thing with Tavares. Tavares lost to Vahitop early on at Glory 9. And I mean, still from that many years ago, you know, Vahitop went on Tavares' mind. And again, Abena catches Tavares getting out of that combination. Yes, Abena seems like he's catching him on the exit. Fight of the night, two versus four. Yeah, left hook, <laughs> sorry, left hook swing and miss there for a bit. This little quarter turn with that left hook is just pivoting to create that angle. Bain moves around. You got to get to work immediately. Yeah, right away. There's only three rounds, so. And again, we do have open scoring tonight. Four of the five judges gave that round to a Yeah, I mean, the more damaging shots, it seems to be landing the power. It seems like Zalsa said they don't care who wins because they want to fight whoever it is with the belt. Zabane and these are doing well, but now Tavares is getting the last answer. Well, you talked about how much Abena was putting behind those shots in the first round. Got to wonder if a little bit of fatigue is going to set in the longer this fight goes on. Yeah, you can see him, like, when he misses those big hooks, there's a lot of energy to recover. He's a little bit out of position where Tavares is pitter-patter, pick, 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 trying to hit, move, create angles. What do they mean? <laughs> Up 35. He's still handsome. Don't get me wrong, all the fans from Abena. As he throws a nasty low kick. Who's landed more strikes in each round. Bana called them on. That's Tavares actually going for the calf kick there. Nice strong low kick from Abena. And even from the last few fights, Abena had some injuries he had to recover, but it looks like he came back fully healed. Knocking Abena's head, hurting him a bit, they would be scoring a little bit better. Well, Tavares is winning this round for sure. Oh, that was a nice knee from Abena. Those knees will split you up very easily. Right now that Tavares, when he moves his head, he's coming back with some punches. Head movements helps you set up power punches, so that could be a good power shot to finish this fight. Tavares needs a knockdown. 10 seconds to get it. He's still throwing bombs. And again, no one home for that back kick. Oh, and a nice left hook. A swing and a miss there right towards the end of this fight. Good action between Luis Tavares and Donaghy Abena. Yes, ladies and gentlemen, we have a winner from this contest. And by unanimous decision, the winner from the white corner, Luis Tavares. I will refrain from speaking because obviously the open scoring scores we had were either completely wrong or 
the ring announcer butchered which one. Yeah, I'm not too sure, but I saw it was a bait to win it. So, I don't know. And but we make it two fights in one. There's our extra round here. Follow the Grolly Grooves and my command, okay? Good luck and stand back. Back his kicks and knees a little bit more. He got a little bit more boxing focus, so I think we'll see him mix those kicks and knees a little bit more this time around. Touch, touch, uppercut, touch, touch, hook. Kick there for Micheletti. Stop, stop, stop! Oh, and that stop. was after the referee stop. said stop twice. She might deduct a point. Only a strategy from the Tavares camp for that calf. It almost looked like Tavares got rocked there. That's better for Micheletti. Micheletti kind of stays with that high guard, so when he moves his head, it's a little bit better for him. Nice counter back from Micheletti, but he's got to get off those again. ropes. And that looked like another sweep again. Like that, there you go. Good head movement by Tavares. Yep, those are those subtle angles I talk about. That head movement, that slipping. Beautiful. Yep. Now you can see when Micheletti's against the ropes, he doesn't do as well. But when he comes forward, a lot of 9 9 rounds again. I think some of those judges okay, so took the. Yeah, Tavara slick with that head movement, counter and back. That boxing is nice of Tavares. Micheletti countering back with as much power as he can. A lot, that's your opportunity to chop the legs. Back kick, nobody home. <laughs> yeah. Even for Micheletti, I think putting punch to kick combinations together would be a good strategy. Boxing. Micheletti just missing with that high kick. Oh, good right hand from Tavares. Got him clean. The stick and move working right now for Tavares. Ooh. Nice counter right for Tavares. Yeah, he, really, he really seems to have found his tempo in this fight. Yeah, but he's, he's comfortable with his head movements is when he's dangerous. Caught him with a quick little right hand on the inside, and again, the boxing of stop, Tavares. Stop. Don't touch the rope, please. Okay? Fight. Yep, back to those low kicks from Micheletti. Deep breaths from Ooh. Micheletti, who eating big power punches to the face. Fatigue, a major issue right now. Spinning back fist for Tavares. See, this is what kind of Micheletti needed to do a little bit earlier, start putting his punches into just the master of distance. Axe kick attempt there by Micheletti. Best round for his kicks. Well, he's still in this round, Joe. <laughs> if he wins this, it's almost a... A draw fight then, right? Or to be a, a majority draw. I don't know. Oh, that buckled the knees. I'm not sure how hurt he was. Seemed like he was off balance a little Stand bit. Back. It almost Stand looked back. like the ropes Stand may have held him up too. That could have easily been a knockdown. A good call, not calling it. Oh, oh, overhand right for Tavares. Oh, parting shots from Tavares. Stop. And that will do it. 30-27, a unanimous decision, all for your winner, Luis Tavares.